Hi, I have a couple of words that I want to share with you that I believe can be very helpful to you in your marriage relationship. And the words are these, just simply be happy. We need to learn to be content. If you always think something has to change before you can be happy, you'll be a victim all your life. If you think, gee, if only I'd, you know, had a nicer house, or only if we had a nicer car, if only I didn't have such insane children, or whatever the thing is, you'll always be living in the world of I'd rather be. Oh, I wish this were different. I was, and if you think something always has to change before you can be happy, you'll always be a victim. The Apostle Paul gave us these words. He says, I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. We know this verse. Everybody loves this verse. We often quote it as some kind of a victory conquering verse, but it's really not. If you look at the context, what he's saying is I've learned the secret to be content in all my circumstances, no matter things are good or if they're bad, whether I'm hungry or whether I'm full. He says, I've learned the secret to be content no matter what. And that's when he says the very next words, because I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. What things? All the things of life, the ups and downs, even when things are terrible and miserable and lousy in our lives, we can still be happy. Our happiness doesn't have to be connected to something else. If your happiness is always connected to your circumstances, you will struggle greatly because your circumstances can come and go like this and you'll always be pushed around. Just enjoy your life. Life is difficult, I get it, but things don't always have to change for you to be happy. If we're walking with God in our lives, we can always be happy, no matter what our circumstances. I always tell the people in my church, don't let life suck the life out of you. Enjoy the road you're on, I tell them. It might be a dead end. <laughs> people say, how will I know? When you get to the end, enjoy your life. If it didn't turn out the way you thought, turn around and go another way. There's always an opportunity to continue to grow in our faith, no matter what our circumstances.